Hello, everybody. I don't want to exactly quit on franchise just because Madden came out. I want to at least try to get through the season. So, all right, let's go to the calendar here. We're going to go play next week's game. Madison Bumgarner. All right. And I moved that since I've been doing pretty good, decent at hitting, I figure I'll just make it back to dynamic difficulty. We got an offer here. What did we get? Marco Torres for Tommy Hunter. How good is Torres? Fifty-eight overall. For oh, screw your face! Get out of here now. Decline. Terrible. Balls. Freaking balls. Mother freaking balls. Hopefully sooner or later I'll become above 500 average again. God dang. Freaking terrible. 29.32. We gotta beat our division rivals. Come on, Yanks. Let's go. Oh boy, classes are kicking my butt, man. <laughs> I I think I mentioned before I have linear methods, calculus two, and physics, and of course my biology courses, of course ecology, and then history is the easiest. But there's three math. Well, physics is type we'll of math. Plenty more from the guys courses are kicking forward, my butt. Before we do, D Gordon. We'll step to the plate now as we're ready to get this one underway. Second Swung on and oh, lifted oh, down the left drop, 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 drop. Yes. And he's going to have extra bases right out of the chute today. Perfect. And yes. He's in there safely. He's got a double. That's what I'm talking about. And you know what, guys? I think this is what you call an early statement right there. This is the first pitch of the game, and he doesn't just go after it. He lashes at this thing. He's going to wind up on second with a leadoff double. Hello. Now a hard liner towards short. Boom. And they're going to strike first this afternoon as this is down for extra bases. And the run will score as the Yankees. Good start. Good start. Pro won't get him. Andrew McCutcheon will stand in now. And he's the right man for the job with runners in scoring position as he ranks fifth in the AL in RBIs. Outside target here, and he hits it for strike one. Well, these Orioles entering play today, Eric Karros. It was another loss last time out, and this portion of the schedule has not done him any favors as they've dropped five of their last... Oh, I hit him. And you know, the little thing... Oh, darn it. Theme on these telecasts for years now, but Smack the pitcher. Losing streak like this, no matter how minor it is, Jake Arrieta's knee like has swollen to twice its way. normal size. A little ice and a few aspirin are all he are required, but he may be forced out of action for a few days. Arrieta will need to be removed from this game. I injured another pitcher. So oh, leave the game look at that. Oh. That left leg. Hoping that it's not too serious, however, as he's able to get off on his own power. Randy Wolf will be summoned now to take over following the injury. Now the first pitch. That's yes! Back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. Bingo! Late their second run of the game as they take a 2-0 lead. So smart here at the plate. You can see he's not trying to hit the ball out of the park. There are times for that, but here he's got a guy out there on third. So this is just a short compact swing just looking to get that run home he's able to get the job done here's the 1-0 -oh. and this winds up inside for a ball 2-0 -oh now and now with a 2-0 -oh count both pitches have been in this might be where you say all right I'm gonna let it fly if this next one's middle away oh yay oh man thinking darn it all it's two and one that's a great call there on two and0 oh. The whole world's thinking fastball, but they dropped the hammer. Uh, That's on the outside corner. Count two and two. Crap. Yeah, he must have been looking for that same breaking ball because that pitch, it's right there. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Now the question, do you send the guy on three and two with one out? 
you figure you're going to get something around the plate. And this oh. is going to be fouled into the diamond level seats. Payoff pitch one more time. Now a cut yes. ball, and this is over, but low. It's ball four. Yoenis Cespedes will dig in for the first time here, looking to change his fortunes a bit as he's seen that average dip these last four or so games. Now a hard no! Ball. The second for one. Oh. She is in time, and thanks to the double play ball, the Darn inning it. is over. Ah, could have got more runs on that. Darn it. Come on. Get warmed up, Bumgarner. There we go. Sebastian Marquez will step in now to lead things off in the home half of the first. Oh, so close. A bit too tight. It's ball one. You know, this Yankee ball club entering play this afternoon here, EK. They come in riding a winning streak, and they've really got things clicking. And they've been as hot as anybody in the league recently. So all they need to do is keep playing the way they've been playing. And you have to say, they stack up with anybody in baseball. Here he comes on two and one. Darn it. And he thought it was strike two. Instead, it goes to three and one. And with the time run in the on-deck circle, the question, does he take go, 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 go. another one here? He just might. You're still going to see a good... Oh, he's safe. If, if oh. And the Challenge. In the inning, we'll Challenge the that crap here. right now. Bull crap. Yeah, I wasn't so sure about him being safe either, but here's one more look at it right here. Can't tell. Tough to tell for sure from that angle. We'll have to wait and see what the signal is from the dugout. Yunel Escobar will stand in for the did I get him? I did. Gonna break out of this little seven-game dry spell at the plate. First offering on yes. the way. Yes. And a swing here by Escobar, but this is going to find the seats down the left side of foul ball. Bumgarner ready with the 0-1. And a fastball way off target here, and it's even at 1. The 1-1 on its way to Escobar. And a fastball uh. too far inside as he's got to step out of harm's way there. I think it's pretty simple. The message here is... Stop leaning out over the plate. A pitcher's got to be able to work inside, so that's just a reminder. And this is on the ground toward the hole. On to gotcha. Bumgarner's roll Booyah. right through him here. Two away now. Bryce Harper uh -oh. will dig in here, and he'll do so with the eighth best average in the American League entering play. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. Now here's the pitch. And the oh, I almost had it. Strike. Yeah, that's a good spot to miss against a guy like this. He loves that pitch up in the zone. Most power hitters do, so that's not a bad idea to give him one above the letters. The one-two. Yes, one, gotcha. Got old Bryce. Strikes for the final out. Okay, Manny. Manny Machado leads things off now in the top half of the second. First pitch coming. Manny Machado. This is uh. down the right field line, but it's going to get out of play for strike one. Machado now on 0 and 1. And this Darn is it. fouled off to the right and back into the seats. Here's the pitch. And he struck that him was out. terrible. Matt Adams will stand in. He comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. 
Fastball here. Oh, thank you. Look at ball one, one and zero. Oh. Yeah, looked like he hit the target. That's a tough pitch to lay off, but he made it pan out. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground towards second. Taken there by Escobar, and the throw to LaRoche is in time. Two gone. Jared Salta Lamacchia will dig in now. He's got that average up over 330 to begin the ball game. First pitch Darn it! Swung on and missed 0 and 1. Yeah, and that's the swing of a guy hoping for a first pitch curveball right there. If he gets it, he hammers it. If not, he's a uh. feet too late. Oh, he can't hold on there as he swings and misses on a pitch in the dirt, and he's down 0 and 2 now. Swung on and hit deep to left center. This one has a chance. There we go. And that a good one. Down out there for extra bases. And he'll make it in there with a two-out double. D. Gordon will get an oh, opportunity here in a run. Another good double. Now following the two-out double. Now here's the first pitch. And he'll lay off the fastball here in a good spot, but ruled the ball 1-0. and For Salto Lamacchia, he's at second with his ninth two-base hit of the year. Oh, much too tardy on the fastball. 1-1. One and one. There's not a whole lot of conviction in that swing. It was almost like an afterthought, like an emergency hack. Uh. As he chases the slider. Uh, and he's always so tough on left-handed hitters. That slider is just so difficult to pick up. Oh, got him looking at the two-seam. Dang it! Adam LaRoche will stand in here, and like so many others, hitless in the shutout last night. Cold strike to the 35-year-old veteran. Nothing in one. And you figure to see that change up more and more as this day progresses. And the first time through the lineup, you want these guys to know that you've got this pitch in your arsenal. Sometimes pitchers want to hold on to pitches and not show everything right away. But here, you want these guys to be thinking, I know he's got that change up, so I'd better not sit on the fastball too often. Foul uh -huh. back. He'll try again, one, two. And a good strike two pitch there as he has to fight to push it foul to the left, so they'll try it again. Again, a one, two. And here's a gotcha. strike three called, and that'll be the first out of the inning. Matt Leaders will stand in, and he's been a tough out these past couple of weeks, as you see the average there over the course of the last nine ball games. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. Now here it comes. Fastball in there for a strike. 92 on the radar gun that time. But this is the thing that's so impressive about this guy. He'll show you that good breaking ball, but then he'll run that fastball up the ladder at 92, 93. Now a swing and a hard hit ball to short. Therefore, it is Ivar. On Boom. First and gotcha. Is set down ha -ha. Two away. Jordy Mercer will get his first opportunity here. And that average is certainly not where he wants it. Down in the 220s to begin the ball game. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing in one. And here's a swing and another chance out there is short. Who is Boom. He's up with it. Throw to first in plenty of time and the side yes. is retired. Eric Ibar is ready to go here as we begin the third. Now here's the pitch. And the first pitch of the inning here misses down and in for a ball. It's 1 and 0. Oh. The pitch. He goes oh. the other way as this is hit in the air toward the gap in right center. Darn it. And he will run this one down, moving to his right, and that's the first out of the inning. Andrew McCutcheon will stand in. He grounded out his first time. And oh, screw your head. Strike one. It's so important with guys like this to get ahead with strike one. Put them behind in the count and on their back foot right away. Tries to shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. Come on. Pitch on the way. Had nibbled the corner there, but missed two and one. 
Well, that's a pretty good spot to try and lock him up inside, but you know he can turn on that location if that's out over the plate. Yeah. yeah. Up the middle, and it'll skip over the bag and into center field for a one-out hit. And now a right-hander up and throwing in the Baltimore bullpen. And will step off and fire to the back. God dang it. I, I hate uh, leading off. I hate it. I always get get off or get out. Now the first pitch. Giancarlo Stanton is in for his second plate appearance as he looks at a ball. It's 1 0. The 1 0 pitch. Not quite reaching 90 with the fastball, but it's 1 and 1 now. Here it comes. On a hole, uh, swings and misses at a pitch in the dirt, and it's one and two now. I'm not sure that pitch would break a pane of glass. That is very tough for a big league. God damn! Like of course, my headsets two have to be freaking dying. Of course. Uh, well, I have nothing to charge it with because the char my USB I'm using to hook my microphone up, so I have to. Use a different headset. Oh, Freaking heck. <sighs> Sets the 2 2 pitch. And the cutter got him. Dang it! Strike three, and the side is retired. Corey Hunter makes his way to the plate to get us started here in the bottom of inning number three. First pitch finds the zone. No balls and a strike to the now 39-year-old veteran. One and one. Ready now on one and one. And here's there a ball we go. hit in the air. And he's going to have room to put this one away, and that's the first out. C.J. Crone will be the batter. First pitch coming. C.J. Crone. In right here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. and And now pitch on the way. Swing and a ball pretty well hit out towards left center. There to take it in is McCutcheon now for route number two. Mike Mustakis will stand in now with two away, trying to avoid another one, two, three inning. Now, this has been total domination these past few innings. They haven't been able to mount any kind of threat whatsoever. There's oh. a fastball pretty close that time, but ruled a ball one and one. Now the pitch. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Now here's the pitch. And he comes back with a gorgeous slider there for strike two. I tell you, he's got a good pace, a good tempo to him out there right now. I'm sorry to interrupt, yes. but that's the third strike and the third All right. side is retired. There we go. One, two, three, go the Orioles. They trail things here two to nothing. Starling Marte will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. First pitch of the inning is taken downstairs for a ball. It's 1 0. Now here's the pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. And oh! The of course, there has to be that little indentation out there. Darn it. So with one away now, a chance for the left fielder to bat with the bases empty. Here's Ioannis Cespedes. There's a first pitch curveball trying to come back to the outside corner. Didn't get it that time. It's ball one. Yeah, he's not really getting on top of that curveball right now. That's going to get him into trouble if he keeps leaving it up there like that. The 1-1. One, one. Bounce toward the hole and through the field for a base hit. Oh. And now he has <laughs> some trouble with it in left. Well, even when you keep him in the ballpark, he can be trouble. 
here he's right on this pitch and he smokes it into left field for a solid single. Here's Manny Machado now. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. The next pitch. 2 and 0 now. And after the strikeout his first time around, I think he was able to use that first at bat as a learning experience. Those have both been real good takes. And he gets this fastball over. It's two and one. Oh, and a good fastball hitter here. To me, that's a little surprising that he wouldn't be swinging away on two and oh. Two one. Ah. Uh. Swung on and hit in the air out to center field. Harper is there now, and he has it. Two gone. The first base. Matt Adams will stand in. He grounded out his first time. Here's the first offering. Here's a two-seamer inside to start the at-bat. It's 1-0. and oh. Here's a 1-0. -oh. He takes it to the opposite field. High and deep. Come on. Go, go, go. And oh. he'll get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Sebastian Marquez will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. Now here's the first pitch. And then oh. this is ball one. And right now, these guys Whoa. just need something to break their way. A blooper, a bunt, a hit by pitch. Something to get a base runner and give that guy something else to think about out there. A little over anxious that time as it's a ball and a strike. And this is low, ball two. Two and one. Now the pitch. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. Here he comes on two and two. Now a ball yeah, yeah. in the air, but in play perhaps down the line. Cespedes will get there as he makes the catch in foul territory for the first down. Yunel Escobar will stand in. He grounded out his first time. And oh, look nice. inside, but that's ruled a strike. Nothing in one. Pitch on the way. This ball's grounded foul. Tap that one. Here it comes. And oh. after the second batter in a row, this is in Oh, there. come on. I hate oh, it. There should be like heat seeking or something in it. So I don't have to be like pinpoint on the freaking ball. Come on. Bryce Harper will try it again. Set uh. first time. In the air to center. McCutcheon is there. Two gone. And no tag at second. He'll head back there with two away now. So we're under in scoring position with two men gone. And stepping in is the first baseman, Adam LaRoche. First pitch here is... Well, that worked out anyways. Into the air. This is way up there, but playable on the infield. Bumgarner has got it, and the side is retired. All right. Jared Saltalamacchia will make his way towards the box to lead off the fifth. Jared Saltalamacchia. Donnie jolts this half inning to attention as the first pitch is hit uh, in the right field for a uh, Maybe I single. could get a double in that one. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right handers starting to loosen up. First pitch to him. And this is lifted high in Come the on, air. Come on, drop, 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 drop. Hunter is over near the stands as he makes the catch for the first down. So a runner at first with one man gone. And that'll bring in the shortstop, Eric Ivar. And here's the first pitch. Now here's a ball hit sharply to nice. the right side. And this will wind up a base hit for Ivar. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Andrew McCutcheon will dig in one for two. He grounded out the first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance. Here's the first offering. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. Yeah, and it seems like he kind of got away from that pitch here in the last few innings. You got to think about bringing that one right back. 
Hammered the other way to deep right field. But this will be off that big scoreboard down there. Hunter able to get it in, so they'll hold the runner at third base. Ah, poo. <laughs> How do you uh, push him over? That sucked. Maybe he's holding up to make sure that this ball doesn't get caught because he doesn't get a very good jump from second base. And I know. I don't know why the really guy stopped. Up nailing him trying to score. Ryan Matthews is going to take over uh. number five as it's going to be up to their bullpen to try and keep him in. Darn it. Here. Throw on to first, and the Yankee threat goes by the boards as the inning is over. Darn it. Matt Wieters stand in to start things out here in the home half of the fifth. And you get the sense, Steve, that this crowd's been pretty well taken out of the ballgame to this point. Yeah, they pretty much had to sit on their hands all afternoon. Not a lot to get excited about so far. And I think that's a credit to that man out there on the mound. He's cut right through this lineup for the first four innings. Outside for a ball, one and one. And now pitch on the way. And oh, he can't get out of the way of that. Well, that so sucked. The man will be on to open the frame. Jordy Mercer will stand in. He grounded out his first time. This ball's hit in the air down the right side and out of play. 0-1. Now about a 58-foot breaking pitch that he wisely lays off here. Orioles still looking for their first hit of the ball game. Uh, swung right over I'm not going that sacking on that. Dribbler out in front of the mound. And he won't even think about second as he'll flip on to first for the sure out. Corey Hunter will dig in here. He flew out his first time around. First pitch on the way. There's a first pitch curveball trying to come back to the outside corner. Didn't get it that time. It's ball one. Swing and a hard hit ball to second. The throw will go to third. Oh, and come on. What the freak? He caught. Oh, my God. I thought he got it. He flew out wow. Runners lead from first and third. Here's the pitch. Fouled straight back. Now, let's try to get a double play here. Bumgarner ready with the 0 1. Here's a hard hit. Oh, come on. Now things are going to start getting gay now. Oh, my. Took a called third strike his first time. Fastball in there for a cold strike. Pretty cool right there. You know, it's so important in a tough spot to get that first pitch strike over. And he's able to jump ahead. Tried to get him to go after the slider, but it's one and two. A classic strikeout pitch there on 0 and 2. It's what Dang it. It's going to. The great recognition there at the plate to lay off. Here comes a 2 2. And he got him. There we go. Sebastian Marquez. Let's see what he can do here with two on and two out here in inning number five. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. The 1-0. -oh. Still won't get him to fish downstairs, and it's 2-0 -oh now. And one thing you can't do here, you cannot lose him and load the bases. He's still got a couple pitches to play with, but I'd expect this one to be somewhere in the strike zone. Here comes the 2-1. And oh, look at him up and in and nearly took his head off. I'll tell you, he's already hit one guy, and he is not afraid to work inside. No, and as much as I hate to say it, pitchers have just as much right to the inside part of the plate as you do. And this will find the seats behind the first base dugout. Here's the 3-2 pitch. And a big Got strike him. out there. He will leave a couple of runners on base, and after a good start to the inning, they can't capitalize any further. Starling Marte will start things out for the Yankees here in their half of the sixth. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. But My God, I can't get a home run. On the run as he winds up just shy of the wall for the first down. Yoenis Cespedes will stride in. He singled in his last plate appearance. First pitch coming. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. Looks like a lefty and a right-hander throwing in the Baltimore bullpen. 1-0 -oh on the way. Swinging a ball hit on Darn the it. ground. But a foul ball, 1-1. One one. Now the 1-1 one one pitch. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike.
Here's the two and one pitch. Now a ball grounded foul over toward the coaching box. Two, two. Here's a ball hit pretty well and carrying to deep right. Uh. And quickly two are gone now here in the visitors half of the sixth. Two away now in the Yankees sixth. And standing in now the third baseman Manny Machado. Here's the first pitch to him. Oh, and he goes down and lines this one back into center field and he's got a base hit. Matt Adams will stand in one of the few guys not to join the hit parade so far now the first pitch here's a line oh, drive right to him. coming off the bat Ugh. pretty much right in the glove that time and the inning is over Yunel Escobar will come in now to start things out here in their half of the sixth as they look for a reversal of fortunes here the first five innings have not been particularly kind to them and I think that's putting it mildly. Just one hit in these first five innings. They're going to need to do a better job of finding good pitches to hit. But that fellow on the mound has not made it easy on him, and that's for sure. Swing and a miss, and he's got yeah. that strikeout pitch working now. That's three in a row for him as there's one away. Bryce Harper will stand in, and he, like so many others, hitless in the ball game so far. And here's a first pitch curveball that bounces on him there. It's ball one. For that man right there, just the one run allowed. The question is, can he make that lead stand up? Well, he hasn't shown too many signs of cracking so far. He's got the look of someone right now who's ready to go the distance. A little oh. bit outside. Two and one. And even though he's pitching well, this is a part of the order that he's really got to worry about. Now they can turn it. Mock, mock, And that's a base hit. Adam LaRoche will stand in. He struck out and popped out in two trips. Swing, hard hit ball to second. Ibar for one. On to yes! It's a double play as their woes continue. That was a nice double play. Nothing doing this time around for the O's. They're down 2-1. Jared Saltalamacchia will lead it off here in the top of inning number seven. Swinging a ball. Oh, come on. on the ground. But a foul ball here, 0-1. Now the pitch. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at 1-1. One Here's the 1-1 one, one pitch. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to 2-1 and one now. And this is something we've seen a lot from him recently. He's worked his way into another good hitter's count. Yeah, it's not unrelated either. When you're going good at the plate, usually means you're being selective and you're not getting yourself out. When that happens, you'll find yourself in these kind of counts. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to 3-2. and two. Well, that pitch is so low and such an easy take that you basically waste that opportunity you had on two and two. And there's a base hit, so maybe some insurance here to lead off the seventh. D. Gordon will get another crack, one for three thus far. First pitch coming. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. A look here at the hits per side here in the late going. 2-0. and oh. And the reason he's working away so much here is because he's got that big hole on the right side of the infield to worry about. But you don't want to give this guy something where he can just roll over a ground ball and still get it into right field. Here it comes, the 3-0. -oh. And this is lifted. Oh, the man. Has him played perfectly as he puts it away for round number one. Eric Ibar will get another shot now. Two for three in the game. Now here's the first pitch. Ah. Line fouled off to the left and a few rows back. Comes set. 
now the pitch. And Ibar Crack. through that one as he falls behind here. Nothing in two now. I think he needs to cut down on his swing a bit. Get a little more compact because he ain't going to be touching those fastballs. And no shortening up here on 0-2. He drills this one into right center, and that's going to find the alley for extra bases. Oh, and this goes right past him. Now it's cut off. A throw to the My plate. Oh, uh, yes. Four from first. Evan Meek come on and pitch here with one gun in the top of the seventh. Action in the bullpen now as a right-hander begins to throw out there. He's ready. Now the pitch. Andrew McCutcheon oh. comes on with one gone here as he looks at a cold strike one. And the infield behind him has come in here, but I've got a feeling he's going to try to handle this one himself. And this ball Darn it. for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0-2 now. He's ready now. The pitch. Ball and two strikes to the 2014 All-Star. I tell you, that was not an easy take. It sure wasn't, especially when you've got to protect on an 0 and 2 count. Rolled foul off uh. the left, so they'll try it again. Here he comes again, 1 2. And here's a ball in the air now. Come on. A bit out toward right center. The catch is made deep in the alley, and here comes the runner. Oh, well, that's all I wanted. Is that sack fire? Fly. It's now a 4 to 1 ball game. Giancarlo Stanton will stride in, grounded out his last time through. Now the first pitch. Oh, he lifts oh. a pop up, drifting into foul territory on the Duh. right side. LaRoche Screw that. is there, and the side is retired. So two runs on two base hits, one error, and no one left on base. Matt Wieters. Stand in for the third time now, still without a hit, so that streak could be in a bit of jeopardy. And I think that's in the back of his mind, but it's not something he's really focused on. He just wants to get up there and put a good swing on the ball. Come on, go, 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 go. Down the right field line. There yes. Stanton, and he's got it for the first out. One gone now for the shortstop, Jordy Mercer. First pitch coming. And a curveball drops in there for strike one. He continues to get ahead here. He's been in complete control. I think you need oh. to guard yourself from being overconfident, though. A bloop and a blast. Yeah. Turn this game on its ear. Pro gets him two down. Corey Hunter will dig in now. Hitless in his two at bats so far. First offering on the way. Uh, start him with a fastball that misses down and away for a ball. 1 0. Here's the pitch. And a fastball runs a bit inside. He's down 2 0. The pitch. Outside. Uh -huh. three you jerk off. Freaking. Taken now on the three ball count. Hit this. Freaking ball crap. And that one's taken wow. For a ball. I meant that to go down the middle. What the frick was that? They've got themselves a two out base runner. CJ Crone set the plate now as he looks at strike one. Yet again, another first pitch strike. And it's a big reason of why he's having the success he is. You establish the count in your favor right away and it oh. opens up the door to so many more options going forward. Here comes a one-two. Dang it. Balls and two strikes now. From the belt, the pitch. Ball swung on and Whew. lifted in there with some carry out towards left center. And as it turns out, the two-out walk doesn't come around to haunt him as that ends the inning. Orioles leave one. And this is still a 4-1 ball game. Yeah, we see a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen up in the bullpen. Here's the first offering. Bouncing ball. God dang it. Middle. Throw on to first and to oh, come on. To open up inning number eight. Challenge that crap. This might happen based on how Bull close crap. was at first. I challenge you, you god dang up first base umpire. How dare you? Well, I think we're going to have to wait and see what the word from the dugout is. But He's here's sick. one more look at it. Man, that's tough to tell if he was out for sure from that angle. And I can see why this was a really tough call on the umpire. 
He was safe. I knew it. That umpire sucks. And a step off. Runner goes oh. for second. Oh, He's safe at first as he gets back in time. First things first. Here's Screw it. Over. Smart to keep an eye on. And he steps off. Runner going a second time. Oh! oh they got him at second. <laughs> oh, man. Dang it. Here's your one Cespedes. Pulled pretty badly there as he reaches to poke this one foul. Now here's the pitch. And he gets a pass uh. here as this ball is fouled away. Eighth inning, four to one is our score. Pitch on the way. A little oh. bit off the outside, it's one and two. Now the one two. That misses, and we're even at two and two. And when he's down 0 oh and two. He's smart enough to know guys are going to try and get him to chase. So now at two and two, he's got himself back to a spot where he doesn't have to go after a pitcher's pitch. Payoff pitch coming. Says put his takes ball four there, and he'll head down to first. Manny Machado will step in. A base hit in his last time. Manny Machado. First pitch to him. Oh, now a ball headed for the alley in right center, and on the first pitch of the at-bat, it's going to find that alley for extra bases. Around third and being waved on home. Now the relay home. He will score. Yeah. Machado delivers the RBI. It's now 5-1. to one. So with a lefty waiting, they'll go to a lefty of their own out of the bullpen here. Now pitching for the Orioles. He's set. Now the pitch. Matt Adams comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. Tough spot here for a left-handed hitter facing a guy that's exceptionally tough on lefties. Yeah, you generally get oh, wait. Oh. Now you're in a good RBI spot and you're stuck facing a guy like this. Now some action out in the bullpen as a lefty and a right-hander begins throwing. Here's the first offering. Jared Salta. Dang it. He's at the plate now, and he's quickly behind 0-1. Well, you can tell he's trying to work that pitch away, but he might have left that one a little more over the plate than he intended. Off the plate, one ball. Come on, I want to bring him home. The 1-1 home. Outside, 2-1. Boy, what a nice job so far of working himself into a hitter's count. Now he can go to work on maybe picking up that two-out RBI out of the nine hole. Wanted to go after the slider, but he holds off three and one. Yeah, and you know what? You've got a better matchup on deck here with two outs. So on three and one now, they may not take any chances with this guy. Driven nicely. Nice. And it's going to get down and should be extra bases. Machado around third, heading for home. And that will score the run from second as they open it up now to six to one. D. Gordon will stand in and I've got to think these add-on runs here will really make it difficult to come back from and that's how they've done it all game long they haven't really had a big inning yet just a lot of ones and twos but those will add up the 1-0 now he goes the other way and he got a lot uh, come on and deep to left center nice field. and that'll get down out there near the wall and that's going to play the runner from second and it's now a seven to one game eric ibar we'll see if he can keep it going three for four thus far now here's the first pitch oh pop -up off darn it the first base side and this is going to get down it's a foul ball he's set now the pitch and I borrow a layoff. That one is even at one and one. Here's the one one. And this is ah. a nice foul into the stands in right out of play. Come down now. 
Here's the one two. Look out. That Dude, one screw you, out buddy. You don't gotta hit me with that baseball, son. No shortage Throw it of back at you. Hits, as you see the totals there. This is well struck. High and deep toward the left field corner. But that'll stay in the park. Oh, so close to a homer. And the run will score from second base as they upped it now to eight to one. And he'll get in there safely. First pitch on the way. And he couldn't oh, get it. Oh, he popped up. Ah. Mercer God dang it. He puts it away to stop uh. the bleeding. Mike Mustakis will stand in to start out their half of the eighth with that starter still out there, and he's definitely been a tough nut to crack. You know, he's been dominant all game long, and I think part of it is that he got himself a nice lead early on, and that's allowed him to not really worry about making a mistake. He's been free and easy the whole way through. Still sticking with the fastball, but this time he lays off. It's one and two. On 0 and 2, if that's a curveball, a, a changeup, a sinker, then maybe you get a guy to chase. But it's much easier to lay off a pitch down there when it's a straight fastball. Hit hard but foul to the left, and they'll try it again. Here's the 2 and 2 offering. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground towards short. High ball Bang. throws to first to take care of him for the first Get down. out, son. And after that four run, he really broke this thing open. Now, as a pitcher, you have a luxury of going right after guys. You don't have to worry so much about making that perfect pitch. If you give up a hit, big deal. You got a cushion behind you. Bumgarner ready with the 0 1. Now a changeup oh. in on the hands that evens it at 1 and 1. Here it comes. And this is hit well oh. the hole. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. Yunel Escobar will try again. He's 0 for 3 thus far. Starts him out with a slider for a strike. Next pitch here will be number 100 through 7 and a third. Now a swing and a softly hit ground Foul ball. ball. But this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. Come set, now the pitch. Now here's the ball hit hard on the ground. Oh. A dive, but he can't knock it down. It's through. Might it's have set. to. And that runner will go no further than second. I may there need to put someone more. in the bullpen here. We'll dig in. He singled his last time around. First pitch coming. First pitch oh, fastball come on. off the plate there, and it's ball one. And some action out in the Yankee bullpen now as a right-hander starts to loosen up. Oh, trouble lurking now. He's got it to 2-0. Oh. Come on! And that's through for a base hit. In quickly with it is Cespedes, and that'll force this the runner sucks. to hold on at third base. Adam LaRoche. We'll have a shot to do some damage, but he can't get them all back, so he needs to just get on base here. Mm, a little tardy there. No balls and a strike. Kind of interesting to see how he's going to respond to this situation. Oh, my God. It's down. It's a base hit. And they'll hold that runner at third, so everyone moves up, and they remain loaded here with still only one gone. Matt Wieters will stand in to keep things going, and I don't know, Steve, is the comeback on? Well, at the very least, I like that they're showing some character out there. You never want to go down without a fight. So they're going to make these final at-bats count. That's over. Dang it. Low, it's a ball and a strike. Would you say he's not really finishing his pitches at this point? That's a good way to put it. It looks like he's aiming a little. And indeed, he'll take only the out at first as the run comes in to score. Jordy Mercer will step in, a ground out victim his last time in there for strike one zero oh, and one i know we have a tendency in the media to get hung up on pitch counts but this is a legit all right there we go Whew. sorry to interrupt but the oh my god for the third out inning over kelvin herrera come on now to start the ninth inning as he looks to keep this deficit right where it is for the bottom of the ninth Now a 
ball slapped hard the opposite way. There we go. And that'll get down in front of Hunter, a base hit. Starling Marte will stride in, grounded out his last time through. Here's the first pitch to him. And he gets ahead here with the Holy pitch. Holy crap, that's one. fast. Just no chance to pull the trigger on that one. It just got on him too fast. From the stretch. Good breaking ball, but he missed inside with it. A ball and a strike. One one on the way. And he Jesus. Fast ball by him here. One and two now. The boys has 99 right through him. One two. Hit softly to the right side. Come on, go 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 go! Throw on to first in time. Dang it! It's like a sacrifice bunt. Yoenis Cespedes will dig in. He walked and later scored last time. And here's the first pitch. And a fastball is in there for strike one. Runner at second here with one man out. From the belt, kicks and deals. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. Here's the 1-1 pitch. Over towards Jesus. the dugout, this one will get into the stands. The right-hander deals on one and two. This is all oh my God. in the dirt for strike three. Just needs to make that easy throw to first. And indeed, the throw will finish him off as they get the foot out at first. And there are two away now. Manny Machado. Try again. Two for four in the ball game. First pitch coming. Fastball. Ooh, that would have hurt. Ow. Right there. Oof. I'll tell you, you do not want to buzz this guy's tower. 1 0 pitch now. And here's a ball lifted high into foul ground down the right. Darn it. Line. Hunter is there and he puts this one away wow. for the third I think out. I'm going to let Baumgartner maybe attempt throw. for the full Corey game, Hunter but if he can't do it, now I'll put Farquhar in. Now here's the first pitch. First pitch fastball off the plate there and it's ball one. And for all the pitches he's thrown, only one walk so far. That's a little bit surprising. A good tailing fastball for a strike, one and one. And this is swung on and bounced on the ground to third. And a good throw gets him one gone. C.J. Crone will stand in. He flew out his last time up. C.J. Crone. And he starts the number eight hitter with a strike. Nothing in one. I know, I know. I'm trying to get him a full game now. Two-seamer. He's been throwing it well all night long. Now here's a Oh, come on, Ghost. John Carlo. Down out near the wall and should be extra bases. And he'll pull in there with a one out double. Man, if I had it just a little this faster right fielder. Come in a situation where you'd like your guy to hit the complete game, but you know, once you get into that 115, 120 range, you have to be concerned. There's a drive high in the air. Come on. Deep to left center field. Catch made out there in left center as the runner may tag from second. Oh, and he runs right through the stop sign. And the runner is in. No! What the heck? Wow, that was bullcrap. Marquez will stand in as their last chance now. He bounces this one. Oh, my God. Come on, Baumgartner. Yep. Yunel Escobar will step in. One for four in the ball game. In there at the letters 0 and 1. And against a guy like this, you're usually only going to get one pitch to hit in that bat. Sometimes you might not even get that. So throw on to first. Jesus. 
My God. Six straight victories now as this one is over. Well, maybe it was a little surprising that he even went out there for the ninth inning. But he gets the job done, and he finishes off the complete game win. And the Yankees' offense was led in large part by this man, Eric Ibar. Put that on a bubblegum card. He's wow, the top player four, of the game. Five, nice. Yeah, Maddie, he definitely led the way. You'll see there. He wow, turned in a that actually really five. helped uh, when I put the, my hitting on rookie because I seem to do much better now. Maybe that's when I when NBA 2K comes out. Maybe that's what I should do for that. Maybe I should start out on rookie till I get better and then raise the difficulty up. That's Really, I try to make, play on at least a respectable difficulty, but if it helps, then I may start on the easiest difficulty. Help with Madden. Yeah, I can play at round uh, higher than all pro. So, you know, something to think about.